name is Samita. In this channel, I share with you my life journey through food. In this episode, we will be making spicy Thai seafood sauce. This sauce, I've actually mentioned it in my previous video for the garden noodle wrap. Now this sauce, I've got to tell you. Once you try it, you are going to ditch your seafood butter next time. I'm telling you this is my go-to sauce for seafood and for everything. This sauce is very versatile. In fact, in Thailand, it is also common to eat this sauce with the table barbecue. Um, so when you go to hot pot or a barbecue table in Thailand, this is going to be this sauce serves um, alongside with many other sauces as well. Along with that, one of my favorite things to eat with this sauce is right here fried egg it is one of the best thing to eat with let's take a look at the ingredients first we have thai chili i'm going to use about three or four of these but you can definitely adjust it however, however you want to but i gotta tell you um with this sauce the spicier the better second i have some garlic here um let's see i think i'm gonna use just two cloves Along. some fish sauce and some cilantro mine is a little wilted but it's okay because we're gonna use the leaves and we're gonna mash them all up anyway first um i have the mold um pestle and motor here you don't if you don't have it i'm sorry i i, I cannot say motor for the life of me but if you don't have these you can definitely use blender for that little bullet you have you know if you have them just pause it okay don't worry about it if you don't have these stuff first i'm gonna throw in my two cloves of garlic whole um i'm gonna peel it i'm gonna peel it in here so this is how tiny will peel garlic I'm gonna add the chili. You can split them to make it easier, but I'm just gonna throw them whole and then I'm gonna mash them. And then I'm gonna throw in some leaves of cilantro. teaspoon of sugar now I'm gonna add the fish sauce so I'll do one tablespoon at a time I'm gonna squeeze in half a lime first This is a juicy lime and it really depends on how much of the juice your lime has. Um, you might need more, you might need less. Now let's mix it all up. Add more lime juice. So this is the whole lime here. Now. I'm gonna add this a tad more. The fish sauce. Okay, perfect. This is done. Okay, now that the sauce is done, let's do some tests. 
I have here the tablespoon I use for fish sauce and fish sauce to prevent any further contamination or saltiness because fish sauce is really strong. Now, I'm gonna scoop this sauce, put it over my egg. I'm salivating. This is an easy sauce for when you want to make anything Thai. In fact, if you ever make ramen noodle and you feel like I don't want to eat it with regular sauce package or the soup it came out, the soup package it came with. Drain the noodle from the water, throw this in there, mix it up, throw some vegetable in, throw some protein, I don't know, um, turkey breast or anything like that, shredded chicken, and there you go, you got yum. And I'll tell you guys how to make that in another video. Nothing is better than Thai fried egg because we fried it crispy as heck. You need to make it at home. This sauce will definitely blow your socks off. Try next time you guys have seafood boil. This sauce, you're gonna forget about the butter. Once you try this, please let me know how you like it. Don't forget to click like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next video. Bye!